Okay. So, thank you, Mr. President. Um, could I ask you just to stay on the stage for a second, please, uh, Jean? Because, Nico, it's been a fantastic year for you, but I know before we got started uh, this afternoon, you wanted to say a few words. Yeah, so for me, um, thank you all for coming. For me, it's a, it's a very special day today. Of course, as you know, to uh, receive the trophy um, this evening. It's going to be uh, amazing. Um, but for another reason as well, uh, I want to take the opportunity to announce that uh, I've decided to end my Formula One career um, in this moment here uh, on Monday. And um, yeah, so to explain, um, it's been ever since I started when I was uh, six years old, I had you know, a very, very clear dream. And that was, um, that was to become Formula One world champion. And it was very, very clear in my mind, you know, as long as I can think when I was growing up. And uh, now I've achieved that. You know, I've put everything into it for 25 years of racing. Um, and with the help of everybody around me, uh, with the help of fans and the help of my team and my family and everybody and my friends, I've managed to achieve that this year. So it's been an incredible, incredible experience for me, um, which I'll rem remember forever. And uh, yeah, so um, at the same time, though, it's been very, very tough also, you know, because um, the last two years uh, losing to Lewis were extremely uh, difficult moments for me, um, which uh, fueled my motivation in a way that I didn't even know was possible um, to fight back and, and to, uh, to achieve my dream finally. So um, this year, yeah, it was extremely tough because I, I put absolutely everything into it. I didn't leave a stone unturned from, uh, from Austin last year, really, where um, where I, I suffered a lot after that loss. And yeah, so I pushed, uh, pushed like crazy in all directions. Um, and along with all my, you know, everybody who was involved, uh, which is also my, my family, um, a lot of sacrifices. Even my wife, for example, at home. Uh, every time I was home, she understood that I needed to rest. So I never did any nights I to take care of our little daughter, you know. Um, never did any nights, never did any difficult things. She was always there to, to support, to make it as easy as possible. And that's just one example of, uh, of the commitment we all, we all put into it. And uh, yeah, that's why I'm, I'm just not willing. I've achieved, I've achieved this childhood dream now, and I'm not willing to, to do that, that sort of commitment again um, for another year. Um, and I'm not interested in coming fourth or whatever. You know, I'm, I, I'm, uh, I'm a fighter, and I, I, I want to win. So yeah, not interested to do that again. Don't want to do it again. Uh, and so I've decided uh, to follow my heart. And my heart has told me. Um, to, s to stop there, call it a day, and uh, go on to, to other things. And it's been, it's been wonderful, and it just feels right. feels right to me. Um, so I, uh, yeah, I'm very, very excited. Uh, my, my wife, Evin, is also very, very excited. She'll have a husband back, and I'll, I'll be a, a dad again then in the next time, which is going to be wonderful. <laughs> and uh, yeah, so that's it. Thank you very much um, for your, your support as well these years. And yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm really cherishing the moment. It's, it's absolutely awesome, all these, uh, all these experiences now, and to share this, uh, this success with all of you and with all the other people has been phenomenal. So looking forward to tonight. One of the most special things for me is also to have achieved it, like my dad has, has been able to win the World Championship, so to share that with him. The first thing I did when I saw the World Championship trophy yesterday um, was to look, where's my dad, you know, to see him, and that's been uh, amazing. And yeah, so that's it. Thank you uh, for, for everything. <laughs> wow, Jean, not so easy. <laughs> Jean, a, a very brave decision from Nico Rosberg there. I just wanted your thoughts on the legacy that he leaves behind. I must say I was privileged because uh, Toto gave me uh, a call this morning at uh, just before we started the general assembly at nine so i mean i was very surprised i'm sure that everybody is surprised but uh, he had demonstrated all the year he was brave i think he did the uh, five six hardest laps of his life in the last race that's for sure you can imagine horrible I mean, <laughs> what are the consequences and uh, and he made it and um, I mean, in the continuity, is demonstrating that uh, he's a smart, uh, brave young boy. And uh, I said to him, I hope you can help us more on campaigning on road safety. So keep the, I don't need the answer right now. Take some time to, to digest. But I'm sure, I mean, you are, you are so gifted. And I, mean, I will say, we are so gifted. Can you imagine? 
I mean, when you see what is happening around the life and uh, around the world, and then to be able at 31 to to decide to to give uh, the next step to your life. So it's a big privilege and uh, congratulations and a lot of, of good luck which you deserve. Thank you.